everyone! Today I'm going to be demoing for you the Rose Bombshell Bath Bomb from this year's Mother's Day collection. This is a gorgeous looking bath bomb. It's this beautiful pink color with green for the leaves showing through and it smells equally as gorgeous. It is like the Rose Jam scent from Lush. It's like um, Rose Jam Bubble Room, Rose Jam um, Shower Gel, Pearl Massage Bar. Um, the only thing is this is a bit more floral um, and less sweet. If I look on the website, it says slip this into the tub and let your troubles float away like rose petals on the water. So it sounds like there's going to be some rose petals coming through. And this um, intoxicating perfume of ro rose absolute rose oil and Sicilian lemon oil. And I'm so excited to use this. So let's pop this guy in the bath. Okay, so it sounds like it's all done. That was very fast fizzing, but the water is a gorgeous coral color. It smells amazing in here. And if you can see, there are little yellow rose petals throughout the bath. So I am super excited to take this bath. Hey guys, so I took my bath with my rose bombshell bath bomb yesterday. And so I quickly wanted to do a little review. This bath bomb smelt really, really good. It smelt like rose jam, but a little bit less sweet is what I read online, and to me it just smelled like rose jam. So, um, <clears throat> and that's one of my favorite scents from Lush, so obviously, loved it. Um, the bath bomb fizzed out really, really quickly. Um, it was very, very quick. Because <laughs> you know how sometimes they have the slow fizzing and some they have the, the fast ones? This one was fast. It was probably all done in less than three minutes maybe even less I don't know but it was really fast however it left the bath water a very very cool color very springish summerish orangey corally pink and it also had yellow big yellow rose leaves through or the rose petals throughout the whole thing and what I noticed was really cool about it was it was very opaque water like my, when my legs were touching the bottom of the bath, you couldn't see them, which I thought was really cool. It's something that the intergalactic bath bomb does as well. It just makes the water very opaque. You can't see through it. And I thought it was really cool that this lighter colored bath bomb did the same thing. So I really, really liked that about it. Um, as far as my, like, the softness of my skin, I shaved my legs in the, the bath, and I do feel like they feel a little bit softer than normal, which is always a plus for me. Overall, I think that this bath bomb is, um, like, maybe a three and a half out of five. It, um, there's no magnificent show, but the fact that the water is, like, very thick or like you can't see through it I think is really cool I also liked the color and the scent um, but yeah it was just a very it was a good bath bomb um, so I think maybe the only things that are making the the review a little bit less is that it I don't feel like the scent enveloped my whole bath bathroom like some of the bath bombs tend to do um, and I don't I think I would have liked it to last a little bit longer I usually like the ones that actually last quite a while and do something um, 
yeah, so that's my review. I do recommend this bath bomb because it is a very nice scent. And if you don't like sparkles in your bath also, you'll like this one because it's not an inch of glitter anywhere. So, yeah. If you guys have tried this bath bomb, let me know in the comment section below. Um, and if you haven't tried this bath bomb, let me know if you are going to try it or if there's any other bath bombs that you have your eye on that I should try. And thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.